Alright, buenos dias, mis amigos. Today I'm going to criticize Mr. Tall23. Alright, so first of all, let me say that I subscribe to him and I enjoy his content and he's uh, he makes great videos. Alright, so um, the thing is he's got something wrong here and I want to take this as a learning opportunity so that somebody might be able to to uh, get some benefit from what I'm about to show alright so first of all let's identify the error uh, for example from the time of creation and Adam and Eve are kicked out of the Garden of Eden to the time of the flood it's approximately 1600 years now we don't know how long exactly Adam and Eve were in the Garden of Eden and we don't know how old Cain and Abel were when um, when uh, when Cain killed Abel etc so we don't know exactly when the, the first few chapters of Genesis how long or how much space of time that took but uh, definitely there's at least about 1600 years between the flood and the beginning of creation so all right so that's wrong he so the error is he says that it's approximately 1600 years from creation to the flood and that's wrong now what I think is that Mr. Tall heard somebody else talk about this and he believed them rather than verifying what the Bible actually says so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna verify what the Bible says alright so now I got this flood uh, this uh, spreadsheet here and we're gonna go from creation to the flood and let me do it this way blow this up as big as I can alright and so we're gonna count the number of years from creation to the flood and we're gonna start off by doing the genealogy of Adam which we find in Genesis 5 alright and so Adam being the first man alright if you don't know then then God help you okay Adam was the first man he was made on day six all right so pretty simple stuff now from so we're gonna start off with Adam and it says right here in verse 3 and Adam lived in 130 years and begat a son in his own likeness and after his image and called his name Seth all right so we're gonna start off with Adam 130 years to Seth and right here in the H column we're gonna keep a running total of how many years it is alright so from Seth now Seth lived in 105 years and begot and begat Enos 105 years and begat Enos and so that brings the total up to 235 alright and then from Enos to and let's see Enos lived 90 years and begat Canaan alright so that's 90 years and then he begat Canaan so that brings <clears throat> excuse me that brings us up to 325 alright so this number is gonna get up to 1656 alright So we're going to get that, oops, let's do it this way, come on now, alright. That number is going to be on the right hand side, on the H column, it's going to be 1656. 1656, alright, so, Canaan lived 70 years and begat Mahalalel. Alright, can't say that name, I can't even spell that name. And what I say, 65, 75, 60, where are we at here? 70 years 
and Canaan lived 70 years, 70 years, and begat Mahalalel. All right, so that brings us up to 395. All right, Mahalalel. All right, and he lived 65 years and begat Jared. 65, and he begat Jared. So that brings us up to 460. All right, and then Jared lived 162 years and begat Enoch. 162 years, and he begat Enoch. So 162 and 460 is 5, no, 622. All right, get your calculators out and uh, verify that math. Well, actually, don't. You can't trust the calculator. All right. I'll try not to get into that. All right. So Enoch lived sixty-five years and begat Methuselah. All right. I can't spell it, but I can say it. Methuselah. Sixty-five. Sixty-five years and begat Methuselah. So that brings us up to six eight seven. All right, Methuselah. All right, Methuselah, Methuselah. Okay, so where are we at here? And Methuselah lived 187 years and begat Lamech. 187 years and begat Lamech. And then, of course, 687 and 187 has to be 874. All right. 874 right so 87 and 87 is 174 plus 700 is 874 All right. okay. now Lamech lived in 182 years and begat a son can you guess who that son was well don't guess you ought to know okay so 182 plus 874 Again, 82 and 174 is 156 plus 900 brings us to 1056. All right, so we're getting close here. Getting close to the flood, aren't we? We're not up to 1656. So that's got to be 1656. And we're 600 years away. And we're at the end of chapter 5. So let's go to chapter 6. Nope, oh, nothing there. Alright, so let's go to chapter 7. And Noah was 600 years old when the flood of waters was upon the earth. He was 600 years old. So 600 years to the flood. So 1056 plus 600 is approximately no 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 we're not doing approximates we're doing exact it is exactly 1600 and 56 1600 and 56 make sure I'm saying that right 1600 and 56 1600 and 56 years from Adam to the flood. 1656 years. And we did that just by simply reading Genesis 5 and confirming the 600 years in Genesis 7. So, <laughs> prophets, etc. Uh, for example, from the time of creation and Adam and Eve are kicked out of the Garden of Eden to the time of the flood, it's approximately 1,600 years. Now, no, it's not approximate. It is exactly 1,656 years. Let's get it right, fellas.